years. Eight-year-old Georgie Pochepsov has been called a pint-sized Picasso, whose whimsical work has captivated the art world. For Georgie, it's just another day in his home studio. I'm like any eight-year-old kid that you see every day. The only difference is I know how to paint. And I love doing it. He lets me go anywhere I want. And oh, the places he goes. Georgie's mind is in constant motion, dreaming up a magical world where art and nature and humanity combine. In my head, there's a world called a paper world, where lots of beautiful things are happening, like person half fish, jellyfish half man, butterfly half beetle. Georgie started drawing when he was only 17 months old. His father, who died when he was three, had always dreamed of being an artist. Georgie's mother, Jubrava, sees her late husband in Georgie. When Georgie was doing his art, Everybody said it probably comes from Oleg. It's the name of my uh, husband's name. And I thought maybe it's happened. Jubrava remembers when art experts took notice of young Georgie. One friend was an artist, and he said to Brava, you have a gifted child. It's very big responsibility. Probably from that time, I start thinking, I have to do something. I have to buy him a good supplies. Jubrava has trouble keeping up with the amount of tools such a prolific young artist demands. His hands always doing drawings, <laughs> and it was amazing for me, and I thought it's just something you can't explain. Art teacher Carol King says Georgie's skill is beyond comprehension. The symmetry and the flow of what he creates and the time that he creates it is just almost magical. Georgie's work is considered so valuable that one collector just paid a staggering $100,000 for a Pochepsov original. For the young artist, it's no big deal. I don't really care if I make money. I just like drawing. Now that's keeping your priorities straight. Way to go, Georgie. That may change in the future, however. <laughs> At eight years old, Georgie has sold over a hundred paintings. Jim and Edie Caminos here just bought one of his paintings and paid uh, $24,500 for it. What made you do that? Well, I'm thinking in, in the years, you're going to get your money back 